And here we go, 145 pound catch weight. My TV and under. The actual movement. This is not where Sandor Martin won. Now, a little bit different circumstances this time around. Ooh, nice shot there on the inside from Sandor Martin. Caught Garcia comes with that jab. And there it is. There's that one two that he throws. Because Mikey is lethal with those combinations. There's a good one two. That's. You know, we talked about this uh, Soto Gonzalez fight, but if this is the style, it's going to have to be in great shape. I mean, it's tough to stay on your back foot and move as much as he's trying to move. Well, he that was a firefight with Anthony. As he starts to let his hands go. But Martin caught him coming in again. But uh, I want to see how Martin's going to act once. Ooh. Mike, so he might be able to take a little bit more from what Garcia normally hurts his. Sergio cleared him out. He just hasn't been able to stop him yet. No, I, I think uh, he, I think it's. A it's only a ten-round fight. Mikey Garcia can't wait too long to get. Either way, this crowd was expecting. And Martinez made this a very. And Martin comes back with a nice jab, just like that right there. Martin has managed to take this. To say he, he likes to take his time to figure out his opponent, but right now we're halfway through in a 10-round yeah. fight. Good left hand. As Garcia is trying to rough Martin up in the corner. And he caught his attention early in this exchange. He's surprising me, so maybe not to school, but he's holding his own and he's definitely in this fight. Then blocking the right hand. Straight left jab, straight down the pocket. Than I expected him to be. Watch his previous fights. He had been reckless. There he lands a nice. Chris, you said you didn't expect to see any ring rush from Garcia. How would you describe his performance from it so far? The right shot, Martinez, and he's throwing him some good pop. There's a right hook again. Be quiet in here. The more quiet it is, you know you're winning this fight. Back with a straight right hand, and he knocks a lot of world-class fighters down. With Round seven scheduled for ten. This fight has moved relatively fast, like you were saying, Sergio. And Garcia, four division world champion, a guy that's been in there with some of the best fighters oh, in the world. Oh, a nice straight left. He's shocked and impressed right now with Martin more than I am disappointed. In this would be as big an upset as it gets. I mean, I don't recall Martin, Martin rather being bugged. Bring back in Jessica McCaskill. Jessica, give some tips to Mikey Garcia. How does we all are? No one, and I mean no one expected him to do this. In recent memory here in boxing. Orlando Salido, Jesse Vargas, Adrian Broner. What? Martin was a 10 to 1 underdog, and now finally Garcia scores with the right hand, and Martin. Now you got to get the respect of him fighting, but then get back on the bike just like that. Cracked him in. The right check hook of Martin that he's been throwing. Hard to say. I mean, you can look at Mikey Garcia and say there's ring rust going on here. As Sander Martin seemingly is beating one of the. Mikey Garcia, I gave that round to him, but I've got an 87-84. He needs a knock. He's trying to convince himself. <laughs> and now meets Mikey Garcia. Look, a little banter there from, from Martin. Oh, these last couple there of rounds. There is not, and it seems like Sandor Martin caught. wants to close the show. What a night for Sandor Martin. Has he just beaten? 8,000 fans here in Fresno really had nothing. Sandor He did it! Do you believe this? 